funny. They don't look like they've ever been read. An expensive potted plant. No idea what kind of plant it is, but it's probably the most expensive one available. A table for clients. Huh. An elegant ebony case. And if I'm not mistaken, that lighter is made of solid gold. Even I can tell someone here's got money to burn. How about the, the painting there? Wait a second. Wasn't there a giant, giant painting hanging on that wall? Yeah, yeah. It was a painting of a uh, fisherman. Wasn't it? Wasn't it? It wasn't very memor. It wasn't a very memorable painting, anyhow. Well, I don't know what else to do now. Move somewhere else, I guess. back is here is because you won't talk to me. Oh, it's my fault now? You, 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 yeah, you don't just have a spiky hair, you also have a spiky heart. That does it. When this case is done, I'm shaving my head. About the man who stayed with you in your hotel room. Can you tell me about him? Where is he? I'm not telling! Look, he's being accused of murder. And I don't think you want to be protecting him. You think you have sold... Would you have sold out to the late Miss Faye to the cops? No. Darn. Huh. Maybe if I had someone to get her to talk. I just noticed these uh, pictures on the desk. What? What are you there? What's this? Old photos? There are two lying here. Some Something's been written on in pencil on the backs. DL6 incident, exhibit A. DL6 incident, exhibit B. Let's take a look at these. Why would Grossberg have a picture of this man? This might be a valuable clue. I'll take it for now. I'm just borrowing it. I'll return it later. Photograph quietly added to the court record. No, that that was a uh, exhibit B. A photo lies on the desk. Maybe I should switch it with the one I took. I think I'll swap them. Photograph added to the court record. Look, I know it was Red White's photo. I just want to see what happens. When you question Miss May and the bellboy about it. Any thoughts about this photograph? Who's that? Your mother? Looks like I have just been wasting my time. No, 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 better by my mouth. They mean to go to Grossberg. What about this photo? Well, that's a fine photo, sir. However, the person Miss May was accompanying 
was accompanied by was a, well, a man. Oh, yeah, right. I just want to, I just want to see what would happen. What the bellboy in April would say. What do you have to say about this photo? Take a look at, the, at this photo. That's him, detective. Uh, I'm a lawyer. Oh, I know that. I just wanted to say detective once. You know how it is. No, no I don't. Without a doubt. That is the man who checked in with Miss April May. How about I write an affidavit swearing that that's him? An affidavit? This guy's way too excited about this. What the heck? <laughs> why not? Well, sure, why not? Yes. I've always wanted to write an affidavit, so... From henceforth, I will be known as the Bell Belly who swore the affidavit. Just hurry up and write it. Affidavit added to the court record. Yeah, even Miss May can pay, play dumb to this. Alright, see ya. Have a look at this. What's that? The bellboy's affidavit. He told us everything he saw. He told us about the man you, you checked in with. He told us who he was. Now I'm, now I'm getting somewhere. This is it. It's all or nothing. Time to do a little bluff. No use playing dumb, if indeed that's an act. If you don't talk, I'm taking this photo to the press. What? Even though he should be a witness to the murder, this man is in hiding. I'm sure the press would have a field day with this reputation. Oh, fine, I'll talk. You, you win, lawyer. Man, that felt good. It's great to be alive. Why are you... <laughs> oh, oh, man, that's funny. What? Why are you pumping your fist in the air? <clears throat> now, tell me about the man you were with. That man? He's my boss. Red one. President of Information Gathering Conglomerate Blue Corp. Red. White? Information Gathering. Well, I suppose you could call, a, call them a detective agency. Hmm. So this is a man that was with you on the night of the murder. Okay, I'll just ask Mr. White himself. Can you tell me where Blue Corp is located? Mr. Red White, at last. Finally, a, a lead on this guy. If April May couldn't have done it, that leaves him. Time to take action. Discarded bellboy, the bellboy's affidavit. Okay, we're going to Blue Corp.
And there's the painting right there. That's about the surreal decor. Welcome! Please furnish me with this title of your personage. What the? Your name? What's your name? I was just in court. I was just incredibly asking the title you go by. Uh, right. Phoenix Wright. Inquirably? Mr. Wright, is it? Right, I see. Splendiferous! Perhaps I have been intimidated you with my gigantic vocabulary. What's with this? What is this guy's problem? I'm Red White, CEO of Blue Corp. You know, corporate expansion official. My business, de my business dealings bring me into contact with the elite of the elite. What? Well, so I, I'm afraid I am not using. I am not used to conversing with the wordly challenge. What a fruit cake. Hmm, let me guess. You're an attorney fresh out of law school, are you not? That's the only explanation for why you would come to meet me like this. What does he mean by that? No matter. So what what's the business what is, what business does a mighty lawyer have to do with a man such as myself? Yep, this guy's in arrogance meters off the scale. It's over 9,000! So I just had to. Miss May's an employee of Blue Corp, is she not? Correct. She was my secretariat. What a shock it, had. it was to hear that she, what she had done. What she has done? You mean the wiretap? Indeed. She, she's paid to answer phones. Tapping them is not in her job description. She, get, she does gather information for us as part of her duties. But I can assure you, we do, we do not condone illegal methods. It is ineffable that she would do this. Sounds like he's trying to turn Miss May into a scapegoat. And then I had the murder. You were in April May's hotel room. Who's this? Who can say? I seldom pay attention to the mundane details such as time and place. My motto is. Don't worry. Be happy. Still, Mr. White. The bellboy has stated on the rec on the record that he does remember you very clearly. No matter. The bellboy can say what he pleases. I still won't talk to you. If you want me to speak, put me on the witness stand. Although I doubt you'd be able to be capable of doing that. Huh, he raises a good question actually. Why didn't the prosecu why didn't prosecution call him as a witness? You should have seen the same thing as April May. Ho oh, ho The police, the courts. To me they're mere toys. Playthings for my amusement. What kind of company is Blue Corp anyway? Oh, excellent question. We buy and sell various kinds of information. We are a company of the future. You might say we are the future. Sell information? 